country, it's Sunday. And it's 49 degrees and it's a little chilly. Actually, it's, it's pretty chilly. Hey, last night was a good night. Yes, it was. What are you doing walking and pushing the mower? Anyway, guys, so I'm on the way to the stove. And I'm going to get some, uh, you know, little Sunday stuff. What up? Biscuits and gravy and sausage and, hell, that's all I want, really. I don't want nothing else. But, uh, yeah, last night was a good night. It was it was good to, to be with the family and be with the sister and the nephew and everybody else. And it was nice that, um, that Shay had a, had a friend come over and hang out with her and stuff. And, uh, it's definitely hard to make friends when you, that when you ain't got none, when you move to a new place. But, uh, hey, I'm just glad it's the Lord's day and we can thank him for the rest of the week. Oh, wait, we got to thank him for today, too. But the rest of the week as well. And, uh, that's just about all this intro. I'm about to let y'all off here because I'm going to be on the main road. And, uh, I'm hungry. Hell, I... I'm still sleepy. I'm not hungry. I'm still sleepy. My eyes are barely even open. But, hey, this 49 degrees, though? Nope. Country car don't do 49 degrees. I'm ready for, uh, 74 degrees. Oh, don't that sound good? Listen, 74 degrees. That just puts you in a good mood just thinking about it. I wonder what the weather's supposed to be today. Hey, get off it. Get off it. Oh, I'm alive. There I am. Get it. So, last night was well needed. It was well needed, but uh, Kira wouldn't go to bed till like 1 o'clock in the morning for some reason. I, she didn't even meet Girl Scout cookies. You'd think she'd at least had a reason to stay up late. When we left my sister's, it was like, oh, uh, maybe 11.30. And she fell asleep within probably 20 seconds of hitting the road. And I was like, oh, she's probably going to be asleep until, you know, till in the morning. Even when I pick her up and carry her in and take her boots off. Nope. Nope. As soon as the truck stopped at the house, she's like, I want some yogurt with chocolate chips. I'm like go to sleep no no nope. she wanted to watch peppa pig she wanted to watch tv she wanted to eat some yogurt she thought it might as, it might as well have been 6 30 yeah i'm like kira it's almost one o'clock in the morning would you like to just stay up until the sun comes up yeah and i think she would have preferred to do so anyway i will see you guys in the next clip and the day continues. Hey, we're letting Rex get some exercise. Rex, you want to say hi? You want to watch me? Hey, buddy. Get it. I'm Rex. Show him you run, Rex. Show him get it. Man, it's in there whining. Go. Good boy. <laughs> Good boy. Yes, sir. Rex, you're not being very active there, buddy. <laughs> Boom. Get it. Hello. Get it. I put him on the head. No, Rex. Go. This is all for... Oh, sorry, I'm dragging all over. Hey, the dog's freaking out. Because, what is it, chihuahuas out there? Female chihuahuas outside. Okay, let's go. I've washed my anyway. hands. Dad, come wash your hands too. I'll, I'm going to wash my hands. You go ahead and wash your hands. Anyway, hey, the day is going on. We just got done eating, uh, sausage and biscuits and gravy and everybody's sitting around the table and you know thanking the law for another day so 
You know what? What? Oh, yeah, I know. Once he gets on the shirt, he don't want to get off. And uh, then we figured we'd get Rex out of the cage and let him run around on the carpet. Get a little exercise. Exercise the demon. He doesn't need any exercise. His exercise is you need, sleeping. Huh? Sleeping is his exercise. Yeah. Her, look at him hanging on. You just gonna take a nap up there, Rex? Probably. Anyway, it'd be a good time to clean the poop out of his cage. Oh, he's got some big, he's got some big old turds now. Down, down, do you dance, do? If my wife lets me, I'm gonna post some uh, some of their videos that they didn't know I was recording last night when they were dancing. But if I don't put them on here, I'm sorry. Because they already told me they'd kill me if it did. But anyway. Alright, I'm going to get off here. Got to clean Rex's cage. It's poopy. That don't sound like fun. But I'm going to do it anyway. See y'all later. Well, guys. Get it. The infinity looks like it's been mudding in the middle of a mud bog but uh we went fishing earlier um we took albert and johnny and uh caden and kira and the wife and the nephew was there my sister was there everybody that was last night was pretty much there and we did some fishing but uh i brought a dead camera so i didn't get any footage of it you just had to take my word for it but uh now we home and uh like i said the infinity looks like uh it's been mudding so I got my little helper out here in her little shiny shoes. Say hey. Hi. Hi. She's out here doing the spraying part while I do the rubbing part. So we're going to get this car cleaned up and we're going to see y'all in a little bit. Well, it's actually almost dark and it's getting chilly, but you know what? I'm going for fishing. Round two. That's right. My nephew, uh, he asked me if I was coming back later, and I, I was like, I don't know. Then I got to laying around. I'm like, oh, I'm tired. It's Sunday. It's, you know, been out all day and had everyone with us, and I was exhausted. But I was like, well, I might. He's like, I need my worms. I'm like, oops. I guess maybe left the worms in the back of the truck. I'm like, screw it. I'm going. The sun's almost down. But, uh, hey, what's a few more minutes of Sunday evening fishing? And I'll come back, the wife's cooking spaghetti, and uh, and I'll have me some good old tasty getty when I get back. And I'm looking forward to it, and I'm gonna tell you right now, I am looking forward to spaghetti. Um, oh, and another thing I wanted to bring up, guys, when Tina is correct, when she said that we're too proud to ask for help um, on Kira's eye surgery, she is correct, which is why I didn't do a GoFundMe or anything else because I, you know, we, we've always, for 12 years, we've always just figured it out. We don't really know any other way. Um, but when we figured that, you know, when we figured this out two weeks before surgery, I think I'm doing more than freak out instead of figure it out. Um, I, I'm already going to be a nervous wreck and I got to pay $3,000 to be a nervous wreck. You know what I'm saying? That's just crazy. Um, but on everybody's end, I want everyone to be safe. I was notified some things, you know, on what to be careful on. So anyone that I know was going to send kind of a large amount of money um, or who have said they were going to, I sent a text or a Facebook message. Um, and I believe it got took out of context. Um, and, and it really doesn't matter. Um, I see their point. I see their side. Um, the point is, is we need screenshots of every dollar cent. You guys need to screenshot your own end. We need records on who sends what, how much, when they sent it, you know, stuff like that. So it protects everyone. We There's so much hate on YouTube. We don't need someone that sends a dollar that says we sent a thousand dollars. Um, there's a, there's a, I could go on and on and on and on and on, but I'm not going to. 
Um, but someone uh, took the took the text out of content. You know, I want everyone to keep their text private. I don't want them sharing it all over YouTube. And then they, I believe, took it personal and then sent it to Tina, like I was talking about Tina. <laughs> Tina's the one that started the fundraiser. <laughs> anyway, um, it doesn't matter. I, I have no no hate toward them. I, I still appreciate them. Um, they're still a fan. They're still good people. I believe it just got took out of context, but that's okay. That's, you know, it's not what I meant by it. Um, but we also don't want any drama over money going to a four-year-old. Um, but anyway, oh, I'm not going to have much fishing time. The sun's already at the tree line, and I'm heading over to go fishing. Lord. Hey, I wonder if I got a flashlight. I hope so, because I want to catch something. Um, hey, on my comments today, you know, I, of course I've been fishing all my life, but uh, anyone that is like a diehard fisherman or woman, I would like some tips in the comments on times of the day or when not to fish. It seems like we go sometimes and we can't stop catching fish and then we go to the same spot in other parts of the day and you could not pay a fish a million dollars to bite a worm or a fake bait or anything else. So, any of you guys that have been fishing for 30, 40 years, you know, as old as I am or something, hey, drop some tips down there. Um, and it's usually pond fishing, stuff like that. So I'm not talking about ocean or, or you know, deep in the river or anything like that. I'm talking about just bass and brim, stuff like that. Um, anyway, hey, I'll see y'all in a little bit. Hey. Hey. Look at him with his cast net. Hey, we uh we obviously at the river now. We 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 gave up on the pond idea and we're down here looking for alligators. And I'm sure there's one close by somewhere. But uh hey, he caught a big old giant brim a minute ago. It was about what, inch and a half? <laughs> The smallest brim I've ever seen in my life, and he got it with a cast net. This pluff mud right here is evil. Evil. That stuff is rough. It'll make you sink. But uh, hey, we gonna do a little more, a little more fishing, and hey, look at that's a nice sunset. Look here. Look at that. Let me get out. Let me get out of the frame there. Much better with me out of the frame. And then got to put him in it. Anyway, so we ain't had no luck yet. But, uh, hey, it ain't dark. And we ain't giving up yet. So, hey, I'm going to catch fish. And I'll see y'all later. Well, the fishing night escapade has ended. I'm actually, look here, I don't know if y'all can see it. I'm trying to work my way out of a like a trail that goes down to the river and oh let's hit the bright light BAM I know y'all ain't gonna see nothing now anyway yeah so uh I got too cold I said uh-uh I said oh 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 it's dark oh anyway I said I can't see I got to go the fish were not hungry I don't believe um, oh, now I'm going straight up a hill. Um, yeah, and the nephew's following me out. But, uh, we got a little too cold. I mean, it's ain't about 50 degrees, but my feet are wet. My hands are wet. Yeah, anyway, it's time to go. I know there's some hot spaghetti at the house waiting on me, and I am absolutely looking forward to that. So, oh, I gotta stop by my sister's, because the wife called me just a second ago, said the my son forgot the Yeti cup over there on the porch or something. So I guess I better go get that. Gotta have the Yeti. Or Ozark Trail or I don't know what it is. It's a, a silver stainless cup. I know that. Um, so I guess it would... Today was a... Uh, how can I put it? In fishing terms. Unsuccessful. That's what, yeah. Matter of fact, I believe the only fish caught by anyone today was 
Alton was another kid that was over at my sister's caught one fish. Nobody else all day long caught a single fish other than my nephew just a second ago catching that little bitty tiny little brim but that wasn't even off a pole that was with a cast net um i was hoping we'd bring up some big old fat shrimp but hey it is what it is um well i'm gonna go ahead and get off here um it oh i don't know today was good and it wasn't good um there was just parts of it where i got real aggravated um so i didn't vlog much guys it tomorrow is monday it is time to get it i will be back in a better mood i will feel like vlogging more i'm sure and honestly i was not going to even put anything online today and even what i am gonna upload is not exactly what i want to put online just because i was not feeling it today but i'm still gonna upload a little something and i'm just hey i'm still thankful that everybody's everybody's doing good everybody's still living and breathing and uh and we got a chance to see tomorrow so that's a that's that's a good enough reason to vlog right there just because i'm happy to see today and i'm happy to know tomorrow's coming so i'm gonna get off here i will see you guys tomorrow on monday and thank you guys for tuning in Country Carter, signing out.